Hello guys, KP Shamino here with another guide and this time it's for the guide how to catch the unique rainbow trout in Oregon. So I was uh, coming here a couple of days ago to Oregon after the new patch. It was the first time that I was here, so that's the patch 030. And I saw a lot of people catching like the unique rainbow. And with a lot, I mean a lot. It was like every couple of seconds they got one. And uh, I asked them what they were doing. And it seems that they were just catching them on the bobber. I didn't know that. So uh, I started to do some research what they were doing. And it is really fun. It's really fun. So you don't need to make a lot of distance. Uh, you can get easily a couple uniques every day. I got today three. So uh, that's not bad. They give good experience. They go give uh, good uh, gold reward. So it's very fun to fish on this fish. So it, it reminds me a little bit of the unique peacock in Florida before they nerfed it. So in this guide, I'm going to show you guys uh, what you need to do. So first of all, what did I do? So it's a level 14 area. So I tried to go with a level 14 setup. Uh, but it was hard because I tried... Uh, it was not hard to get the equipment, but it was hard to get the bait. The main problem is you can use a spawn sack, you can use a cricket, you can use uh, like other trout bait, but I didn't get unique with it. I think you can get unique with it, but it's so low compared to shiners and large minnows. Large minnows are so good, you just throw it in, you every time got a trophy, you got a unique. So compared to those baits, the other baits are not that good. So I think it's best that you need to wait until your level 16, get the large minnows and go for the unique rainbow. Okay, first of all, uh, the position. So the position is, uh, yeah, of course, in Oregon. You need to go to Trout Lair. Uh, yeah, Trout Lair. So just go over here. And what you need to do is, uh, yeah, they didn't really move the, the rainbow uh, unique. It's now a little bit shorter, but in the past it was shorter too. Uh, but you didn't get unique there. So what you need to do is you just come here. So just go to the left here of the weeds. Yeah, it's not left, it's right. So go to the right here. And my bobber is doing strange stuff again. Yeah, look, my bobber is over there in the water. So, ah, okay, it's back. So go to the right of the weeds. Just stand here. And you guys know the waterfall. The waterfall was always a good marker to get the unique. So what you need to do is you just need to go here to the left of the waterfall. And this area is good. So between 10 and 20 meters, you can catch the unique rainbow trout. So you just need to throw in. It's uh, not really that hard. So just throw in. And that's perfect. So 70 meters, you can come a little bit close, closer. You can go a little bit further. So it's not a complicated fish, but it's very fun to fish on. If you come here to Oregon, you always see like, like 20 people are here. They are just slaying. The unique rainbow and that's fun if you can catch oh and i already got a fish on so let's have a look it will be really cool if it's in unique but i don't think it's too unique i think it's probably a trophy no it's a normal one okay that was it for the position so for the time frame in the past we fished uh, between uh what was it 12 I'm not sure it's a.m. p.m. It's, it's on the edge, so I think 12 p.m. until 6 p.m. But the main problem those days was that we didn't get a lot of unique rainbows. So now you can get a lot of rainbows and the time frame is now between uh, 11 a.m. until 4 p.m. So I'm not sure that was always the case. I think it was always the case, but in the past it was way too hard to define the right time frame. But now it's from 11 a.m until 4 p.m. It's possible you can get a unique outside that zone and you guys can always post it in comments. It's not a problem. So that's the time frame. Now it's time to check the setup. So I already said to you guys, 
I went with the level 14 setup just to check out that it's possible to catch him if you come here. By the way, guys, if you're a level 14, you cannot keep this fish because you don't have the license for it. You only can keep the unique rainbow trout on level 15. Okay, so you guys can use this setup. It works for level 14. You can go with uh, all the trout bait that is possible uh, for that level, of course. But I'm not sure that you can get him. I think you can, but I didn't get him. Okay, so this setup, it's a little bit gold heavy. It's always like that. If you can catch a unique on your starting level for that place, you always need to buy uh, gold equipment. Otherwise, you never can do it in this game. So I'm using the Phoenix 319. It's gold, five and a half kilograms test. That's perfect because the rainbow unique goes 3.3, 3.4. It's a very, a very hard fish to catch because he gives a fight. Therefore, I'm using this setup. I go like very high above his weight with my test because otherwise you break stuff. So I started here. Uh, with I think it was uh, this one so the Espira MLR 3000 was 5 kilograms of test main problem is you need to go I think with the bread four and a half kilograms and I had some trouble I got the fish but he spooled me out until 80 meters so it works too but you need to be patient don't go like an idiot on the fish let them call him down reel in a little bit call him down reel in and so on then i'm using the spira ml 3000 it's 40 gold too but it works like a charm and if i can have five and a half kilogram on my reel too i can use the mono and that's the perfect example of a good setup the mono is like 5.4 kilogram of test, so that's like a little bit under my rod and reel. And therefore it's a really good setup. Of course you can go with a Pira MLR 3000 too, but then you need to go with uh, the 0 0.20 bread. Okay, so you don't need to use this setup, it's very expensive, you just can wait until you hit level 15. And you can go with like uh, a currency uh, reel. You cannot go with the currency uh, rod because they come, I think, at level 17 or 18. So you always need to have, uh, give gold to get the good rod. I'm using the chubby bobber and this is very important. It's a trout, so trout feet at the bottom. So you need to go on maximum depth. Okay, this is the setup guys, be sure that you can handle 5 kilograms on your test and you will be perfectly okay. If you go under the 5 kilograms on your test, sometimes it can be problematic, so you need to watch it a little bit. It's strange because the fish is only 3.3 kg max, but he gives a fight that uh, yeah, can go over that number of 4 to 5 kilograms. Okay, this is the setup guys, let's have a look at my net. And you guys will see it right away. So you got shiners. So shiners are not bad. And if you check my net, you guys are going to see. Uh, yeah, but it's not true what you are saying. But I say now large minnows are better than shiners. And what do I mean with it? I will show you guys. So shiners always give like rainbow trout normals too. Gives of course uh, trophies too. And uniques too. You will see it. But... The, the number is a lot lower. If you see the large minnow here, it's always trophy, 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 trophy the whole time. So I didn't get one normal with the large minnow. So it's, it's better than the shiner. But then the strange thing is, of course, therefore I said it at the start of my net. I got two uniques on the shiner and only one on the large minnow. But that's just RNG. So I think large minnows, if you hit level 16... Get the large minnows. Uh, you will. I'm almost 100% sure that you make a profit, even if you need to buy, uh, buy them with gold. If you don't want to spend gold and you're level 17, you need to go with the shiners. So that's the best. There is not a lot I can say more. It's very fun to fish on. I like it a lot. Oregon is a good place. And I got three uniques today, so that's 17 gold, almost 339 currency. And I think I got a nice amount of experience too. A lot of guys stay here now until level 18 and even after level 18. So they just keep uh, Florida. They stay here 
just to get the unique rainbow trout. That was it for this movie, guys. I hope that you liked the movie. Thanks for watching and see you guys later. Bye bye.